cold. An arrowhead carved from bone. This looks like Mongol craftsmanship. Byzantine war galley. How the hell did it get down here? Mongolian. They passed through here. I must be close to the lost city.
The Maria Adula is trapped. The ice gave way. Her spine snapped in two. No matter. While I hope to wield her cannons against the false prophet, we will continue on foot. I have six of the Order of Trinity's best, and we have been stockpiling food and supplies while the sailors starved. They do not know it yet, but they will give their life for the cause. My men and I will find our way out of these icy caves and continue on foot. Before the ship was swallowed by the ice to the south, we heard music. That will be our first stop. But first I must rest. The cold has sunk into my bones, and I am drowsy. Just a little sleep. the ice somehow.
now to find out what's up there. and the madness of the Order of Trinity. My ship will never see water again. We entered the glacial sea too far into the winter. Would have been turned back, but Coraldus would not abandon this lost prophet. He and his dead-eyed warriors seized control. He forced the ship through shallow tributaries until we could go no further. Then he made my crew construct sled runners, and the bastard forced us to tow the ship over land. It was death and excommunication to deny him. But it was death either way. I will make sure he dies here with us. I have always kept a little poison at the ready in case the ship was taken. Now it has another use. archery techniques of the foes of the Byzantine Empire.
I'm not your enemy. That remains to be seen. You killed those men back there. I killed them to survive. I suspect you did too. How long have they been here? Days, at most. The invaders took many of my people prisoner. You should leave this place before it's too late. I can't do that. I came here for something important. So did they. If I see you again, I'll put an arrow in your throat. You and I are on the same side. I hope I can prove that to you. What's going on down there? Who? So, there are people who live out here. And they appear to have been here for a very long time, living in isolation for decades, maybe even centuries. Just got word. Constantine is on his way down. We're gearing up. I was on the first flight to Siberia to secure the old Soviet installation now. More arriving every minute. Constantine gave a speech to the new boots, and I stayed in the back to watch. Love hearing him speak. Never gets old. I was never much for believing, but it was just words before this. It's something more. It's truth. I was broken once. But Trinity is making us whole again, giving, giving us a purpose. A new world awaits. Even those who don't believe will have a part to play. Listen. We need to get this mess in order before he arrives. Hey, can anyone hear me? God damn it, we gotta get calm. Rushing three armed men with an axe? I think I heard something. I'll take a look. Understood. Keep her down! <laughs> Laying down cover fire! The 
There's more of them arriving. I know I've taken some jobs of questionable legality, and I know you're not happy about it. But I couldn't pass up this contract. Been trying to get work with Trinity for years. They're discreet, the pay is obscene, and they always have opportunities. Now here I am, and I already want out. We're at an abandoned Soviet installation in the middle of nowhere. No one's telling us low-level contractors what's going on, but... I think I might be helping some seriously scary people get a nuke or something equally awful. Honestly, that's the best case scenario. Ping me back if you get this. I've carved out a secure channel on the network. For an operation like this, you'd think they'd have better security, but I guess that's why they hired me.
That's it. We're out of time. Shoot him. He'll talk or he'll bleed out. The Red Army is coming. I've been tracking them for weeks, watching as hundreds of men build the iron monstrosity across the ice. Men have died, their frozen bodies left scattered in the tundra. No rites of passing, no burial or burnings. These new invaders are cruel, godless men. Do they come seeking the precious metals of the mountain? Or like so many before them, are they drawn here by the divine source? My people must again prepare for war. How's it looking? Ah, I'm not sure I can stop the leak. Did the work, we'll have a grip to fight, and get a new back. Not sure we'll be able to find spare parts out here. I left you in charge here. Yes, sir. But we didn't expect such heavy resistance. You were to be my eyes. I expected you to see. You must know what is at stake with this operation. Yes, but no. No. You don't. No. How could someone like you? Go easy. Go easy. Don't fear the suffering. Our goal is within reach, but we must be vigilant. If we succeed here, a new world awaits. One of our own making. Constantine, you're needed back at the prison right away. We've got a captive who might know something about the artifact. Remain faithful. We will share in the glory of the Divine Source. What do we do with him? No. Nobody touch him. Looks like we got another fuel leak. What the hell happened? This thing is 50 years old. Yeah, it looks like the valve failed. 
All right, let's get it shut. We can't afford to lose any more after that attack. Okay, I got this. Hold that part steady. Just need some more leverage. Damn it. Coupling is stripped. Wanna give me a hand? Yeah, sure. Still having trouble with the old fuel system. What was that? Don't raise any red flags yet. We're working on it. all this goddamn fuel. How's it look? Damn it. Hold on, that's too much force. Take it easy. Goddamn thing is rusted. Oh, over there! Over there! Right there! Constantine is here, the man who tried to kill me in Syria. He's violent, dangerous, but worse, he appears entirely devoted to his misguided beliefs. I seem to have a habit of running afoul of religious zealots. I suppose it all goes with the territory. His men on the radio mention a prisoner with information. Could it be one of the natives I've encountered? And if so, what does he know? Trinity will not be kind in their methods. Perhaps I can find him. Find out what he knows. Earning the trust of the locals might prove you. Yeah. <clears throat> <clears throat> 
Don't shoot. I'm not your enemy. Who are you people? All that can come later. If you want answers, then listen close. We've managed to destroy the old radio tower, but there are repeaters that keep them connected. We need to shut them down. Help me, and I'll let the others know they can trust you. We need all the allies we can get. I'll keep an eye out for them. Good. We don't have much time. I've infiltrated the ranks of the enemy and learned that they come seeking the rich resources of the mountain. They appear to know nothing of the secret we protect. Those who build the Iron Road are themselves prisoners, slaves of the Red Army. Massive machines now use the Iron Road, bringing more slaves, food, and raw materials for construction of a small city. It is time for me to return to my people so we might plan our attack. If we can inflict heavy losses upon them before they reach the mountain, they may give up and turn back. We were fools, careless, arrogant fools. We thought we could stop them, but the Red Army outnumbers us. Their weapons are superior, and they just keep coming. Many of my people, including myself, have been captured, forced to work the mines of our own mountain. It's only a matter of time before they decide.